associated with this Miss Lyon? I never heard of her. Well, you may have known her by the name of Lyon. Miss Lyon wasn't her real name. She had a big record and her fingerprints were on file, so we were able to identify her without much difficulty. Her real name was Maureen Stanley. Her husband was a farmer, John Stanley, who resided not very far from here at Longridge Farm. Longridge Farm? Wasn't that one of those children? Yes, sir, the Longridge Farm case. Hi, I'm Sherry Marvin. I'm directing The Mousetrap here at Fort Moth Community Playhouse. It's a um, departure for me. I do a lot of comedy and some youth shows, so it's back to my roots of directing a nice dramatic performance uh, with adults, and it is coming along wonderfully. Police! Police, did you say? Yes, they rung up about a half an hour ago. Said they're sending down an inspector or something. My name is George Weldon. I play the character Major Metcalf. Uh, we're having a lot of fun here, and uh, Tom is, is doing his usual spastic motions, but uh, besides that, everything's cool. Sure. Thank you. Is that an Argyle sweater? Is that actually Argyle? Did you know that the central heating in the library is practically stone cold? I'm so sorry, Mrs. Moore, but we're a bit short of cold. Now, I pay ten quid a week here. Ten quid. And I do not care to freeze. My name is Basha Watts. I'm a board member of Fort Mill Community Playhouse. I've been with them not quite one year. Um, this is my second production with them. Previously, I spent a lot of years with Clover Little Theater. And I'm looking at your beautiful wife. <laughs> I doubt that. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I have really enjoyed working with these cast members. They are wonderful. I love them all to death. My role draws the last run into a snow drift. Blinding snow everywhere. I do not know where I am. Perhaps I shall. Take a little bag. I could be a thief, a robber, a fugitive from justice, a madman, even a murderer. Oh. My name is Don McManus. Character is sure? Mr. Parrot, but I'm uh, <laughs> supposedly <laughs> smuggling. Okay. And please, please don't enjoy eat. Oh, uh, performing and with the Fort Mill Community uh, Theater. Perhaps an unhappy childhood. I was very happy as a child. You were lucky. Weren't you happy? No. I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. It's a long time ago. One tends to forget things. Oh, do I really have to tell you who I really am? <laughs> I'm Angela Lux. I live in Fort Mill. And I'm tonight, I'm Coswell. Leslie Coswell. And I am, I'm playing a manly woman, if you, I hope you can tell. <laughs> and know that that's not really me by any means at all. Because I'm a mom. <laughs> I believe is his name has to say, and to follow his instructions implicitly. Isn't that extraordinary? Hmm. What on earth do you think we've done? Yeah, what do you think it is? I don't like doing these things. I'm Tara Watts. I'm not related to her. I wish I was related to Basha, but I'm not. And? Uh, Michael Pleasant, and we are uh, Giles and Molly Ralston, the proprietors of the house. And we are Married on stage and no. uh, real practically. Life, practically married. <laughs> Boyfriend, girlfriend off stage. Ah, thank you, sir. Detective Sergeant Trotter, Virtue Police. Uh, can I get these skis off and stir them somewhere? Go! The lines could be cut. Cut? But who, who would cut it? Mr. Ralston. How much do you know about the people who are staying in your guest house? My name is Brian Holloway, and I play the role of Sergeant Trotter in the show. Uh, I work professionally as a costume designer and a makeup designer for film and television, and uh, you know, responsible for creating my own uniform as well. I find people so mad and interesting, don't you? See, the only people who really know what people are like are artists, and they don't even know why they know it. But if they're portrait painters, it comes out on the canvas. But just wait, Mrs. Boyle, till I creep up behind you. And you feel my hands on your nose. Oh, stop! It. 
That little Christopher, that's a poor joke. As a matter of fact, it's not a joke at all. Oh, but it is. That's just what it is. It's a madman's joke. That's what makes it so deliciously bizarre. Hi, my name's Thomas Moody. <laughs> I play Christopher Wren. And Christopher's kind of feminine, but I'm not, as you can obviously see. I'm very manly, like my good friend Coswell. I made this dip. I stayed up late last night at the trailer. I took my time, and now I'm here. I'm here to entertain you, one day at a time. Thank you. That you are alone in a room. Late in the afternoon, the door opens softly behind you. Oh, it's you. I can't find one program worth listening to. Here, where did you turn out those lights? What, what are you doing? <coughs> 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 